town, a young man got released from prison. He took a picture and it went viral. Last time I checked, it had like over 7K uh, likes and like over 5K shares. And so as I'm looking at the comments and the shares, I see nothing but a bunch of women that's just throwing themselves at them. What? Hey, daddy, welcome home. You so handsome. And I know I'm good for some. And I got a cash app for you. I got Nike outfits for you. And oh my God, can I be your baby mama? This must be where all the real niggas are. They're in jail. And I'm just looking at this nonsense because I thought to myself, I'm pretty sure if this was a post of a man starting a business, you know, working with the youth, you know, getting his CDL, whatever the case is, he would have not went viral. I just want to make sure I heard that correctly. Did she say in jail? Yep. We're living in a society in a time where women can't get a man, so they resort to a jailbird. And this is what I'm saying. Women have no shame, no accountability, no nothing. They always want to blame somebody else for their mistake. Yep. And then when this guy gets one of you pregnant, all of a sudden he's a deadbeat. He's a deadbeat. He's this, he's that, but you slept with him. The women never take accountability for their mistakes and they're always placing the blame on somebody else. <laughs> What's going on everybody and welcome back to another video. Don't forget, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, click on that notification bell. That will let you know every time I upload content, you know what we're going to do. We're going to roll that clip. You know, nothing like that. So women have a hard time accepting accountability for where it literally stands. It's no disrespect to the young man, but the question is, what exactly could he do for you guys when he's fresh home from jail? It's not like he has his car, his financial situation situated, a house. He's fresh home. But watching all of these women just throw themselves at this man, it's like because women love to be in competition with each other. It's more of a who can get them first. It's more of a I have some of that. It's more of a it's like a validation thing. Whoever wants to get seen with them first, whoever can get them first. And that's what women do. Y'all fight for like this spot out of a million other women just to try to make yourselves feel like, oh, well, I'm the one that got them. Not to mention, if I'm not mistaken, I seen someone say that he had a girlfriend. So now that puts his girlfriend in a super uncomfortable situation because 7,000 other women cannot respe respect the fact that this is this girl's man. And then I even see one girl say something like, oh, he's good as fuck. She might as well get used to it. And it's like, that's insane. Because then you got to ask yourself, does this man have what it takes to really back off 7,000 women? You know, that's a lot of temptation. So y'all put this man in this, you know, compromised situation. And now his girlfriend has been holding him down, waiting on her man to come home. Now it has to go up against a bunch of thirsty, pressed ass women who just finds it cute and funny and a thing to do let's just see who can fuck him because that's pretty much all he can offer at this time is some dick so it's like y'all will be the same seven thousand women that will go into the universe and swear that all men ain't shit once you get played let's just say he accidentally get one of y'all pregnant and now he can't take care of the baby because he's not in the position to take care of the baby and you'll be the same one screaming that he's a deadbeat and these men ain't shit i want to make myself very clear here women choose horrible partners this man is in jail and you're throwing yourself at him no wonder why we're doomed as a community we live in a society where our women are so down bad for a man that they're gonna use and try and get with a man that can do absolutely nothing for you. And then you're going to throw yourself at a man. This is the reason why so many men are unhappy. They're in relationships with women that treat them like trash. That yell at them. That treat them like children. That make them feel less than. And then when they get caught looking at another woman all of a sudden it's their phone 
Okay, I got some cold water here, boy. Some cold water. Some cold water. Lord have mercy. We must stay focused, brothers. We must stay focused. Women cannot maintain relationships. We live in a society where women date based on feelings, how they feel. Think that older men that date younger women are grooming them because that's how they feel. They feel, therefore, they are. They don't realize that your feelings are just that, your specific feelings. But you don't feel the need to correct other women. No, not this time. It's totally made up. Pure fiction. It's fiction. It's fiction. We made it up. We also live in a society where it is very hard to find somebody that's going to treat you right, do right by you. We live in that society. And women are so down bad. Again. You're dating a guy that can do nothing for you. This is the reason why the Pookie and Ray Ray is so undefeated. I like drug dealers. I like scammers. A nine to five. I don't even work a nine to five. <laughs> I want about you. What's your type? What you I like? like drug dealers. Dark she skin. Lied. She lied. Drug dealers and scammers, y'all. They gotta have money. The nine to five money. guy or a perk head drug dealer with money. Perkhead. A perkhead drug dealer with money. Perk drug dealer with money. I'm with the perkhead with the money. A drag dealer. I like drug dealers. How bad is the perk addiction? Women aren't looking for a help mate. They're looking for help. They're looking for somebody to pay their bills, pay their rent, take them shopping, get their hair and nails and feet done. But in reality, they're not going to give you anything. They feel that their body is enough. They're like, as long as I have a fat butt and a nice set of boobs, I'm good to go. We men, we are saying, no, you've got to come with more. We have more women that know more about OnlyFans than they do about pleasing a man. You know how to please yourself, make a man shot for you, drain his resources and wallet. But when it comes to being a woman, you fall short. It's like I always say, men, we want a real, women want a real man, but we can't even get a real woman. Fake hair, fake nails, BBLs, we, there's no real women anymore. They're all plastic. But then you have the nerve to get a real man. You want a real man, but you're not even a real woman. And see, this is the society. Women of today, they're more concerned about outdoing the next woman. See, this is the mentality of women. They want to get a man who can do nothing because they want to do everything because it's a control thing. That's the reason why they like Pookies and Ray Rays. It's a control. Modern women need control. They need to control you. They want to control you. They want to run the relationship. They want to tell you what to do. They want to treat you like you're a child because they need that. They need the ability to control you. As a man, it is in your best interest to not date modern women because they will control you. That's the reason why 
If you notice, modern women get in a lot of arguments. They get in a lot of disputes. Why? Because they deal with weak men that aren't going to stand up. See, the Pookie, he already knows that he has the player's cards right because if he doesn't, he's out the door. At the same time, he can get away with a lot because women typically will date a man that's of lower stature, of lower success. That's the reason why a lot of women focus on their career. You're focused on your career because you want to be a man and that's why you date pookies. It's not about a help meet. It's about you need help. You want to make all the mistakes in the world when you're young. And then when you get older, you want somebody to help you. Not help you as in, I have goals, I have dreams, this is what we're going to do. No, I need my rent paid, my light bill paid, my car note paid, my phone bill paid. You got to help me. I'm going to make all the mistakes when I'm young and make another guy pay for it when I get older. That's modern women. This is the world that we live in. And then you wonder why we go overseas. This is why. Anyway, y'all, that's been it for today's video. Don't forget, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, tickle that notification bell that will let you know every time I upload content. And until the next video, peace.